Hey guys, so, um, I just said a few minutes ago, well, a few minutes ago, it was actually a couple hours ago in real life, but, um, I had said that I was going to go outside on the, on my last video and, um, make, what do you call it, uh, I was going to do my comments and stuff like that. Oh, by the way, what do you guys think of the little backpack style purses? This one's, like, studded, and it's just a little tiny black backpack. They always remind me of the 90s because that's kind of like what my mom and, and aunt and stuff used when I was growing up. So it like reminds me of like the fanny pack days, I guess. But I saw this at, I don't remember, it was a store at the mall and I just had to have it. So no, it wasn't even a store at the mall. It was actually Beatty's Discount. Um, but I just thought it was super cute. So I bought it and I've been using it lately and I kind of like it. But I'm curious if other people think it's cute. So let me know what you think of my little new backpack purse. So, um, I need to take some medicine, so that's why I have this out in the first place, but, so anyways, I said I would take you guys out, outside with me, um, while I read the comments and stuff, so anyways, my day got busy and stuff, and I didn't get around to it, but, I'm gonna do it now. So, um, let me see. Ah! Um, oh, you can't look. Shit, I'm gonna have to make it bigger. Alright, hang on. Let me take my medicine and then I will do this. So, um, did you guys like my makeup stuff? I hope so, because I really enjoyed making those for you guys. Um, it was a lot of fun because I feel like makeup is something I really do know. So, every time I take my medicine, if it's little and I take a drink, I always worry it's going to slip down the straw and I'm not going to notice. But it's so small that when I fill up my mouth with soda, I can't tell if it's still in my mouth or not. I just kind of swallow and hope it, hope it is. But Okay, so anyways, um, Nate the Grace in the other room watching TV. Um, and I'm going to do this. So let me see. I'm going to lay back and get comfy. Let me see. see what I can do with y'all. Alright. Oh, that's nice. So it's kind of like we're hanging out in my bed. Hey. So, let's get started. I'm not going to be able to see the screen, so I hope you guys will be able to see. And, oh, I don't know if you can hear me because of the thing. Well, I hope you can hear me. Alright, so. Let me just. God, I look fat right here, huh? That's not attractive. Um, I don't want to look fat on my video. Yeah. I'll try to turn on my side cover. Alrighty, that works. Okay. So. Let's check this out. Congrats, your video's on YouTube. Let me refresh my Gmail real quick. I'm sorry you guys can, I know you can hear the click and stuff. That's got to be a little annoying. All right, so let's start at the bottom. Started from the bottom, now we're here. Okay. Mm. Get ready with me, club makeup comment posted part one. You are so pretty. Thank you for doing this video from Taylor Vespucci. Thank you, Taylor. I really appreciate that. Um, you actually look really cute in your... Uh, contact picture, whatever it is, too. So thank you, and you're very welcome. I really enjoyed making the Get Ready With Me video. Um, even though it was so freaking long, it had to be in a bunch of parts. Okay, let's see. Get Ready With Me Club Makeup Part 2, comment posted by Pretty Zombie. You're cute. You're cute, Pretty Zombie. <laughs> That's a dope-ass name, too. <clears throat> Alright, let's see. Sorry, I can't really see because of the change colors. Alright, comment posted on Get Ready With Me Club Makeup Part 3. Your makeup looks so good. I'm interested in becoming a stripper, but I've never makeup before. Any tips for a newbie? Mercy Mason. Okay, that's the person who asked me to make, up the, make the beginner's tip video. So, Mercy Mason, um, I have made that for you. It's in two parts, and it's posted and everything. So, let me know if, you, if it was what you were looking for, if it gave you enough information, or if, like, that's not what you meant. But I hope it was right, because I listed as many tips as I could think of. All right, so now, message. Um, okay. Figure ice. Yeah, figure icy. Oh, she's cute too. You're cute too. Um, two Emma Dope Glam. Thanks so much, girl. It's so nice to ask these questions without being called a slut or a whore. 
keep up the great vid, smiley face. No problem at all. Like, I really do enjoy, like, helping you guys out because that's exactly, well, not exactly, but very similar to how I felt when I started dancing. I didn't have anyone to ask and stuff, and, um, like, people don't want to share, like, the girls at the club don't want to give you their hustle tips, and the people in your normal life won't be able to tell you what you need to know. I was on YouTube and Google constantly looking for stuff, like, information and tips and all that. Um, I don't know if I've said so before, but check out stripperweb.com, all, all in word, stripperweb.com. Create an account there. Um, that is like a forum. There's, I'll pull it up right now and just read a little bit off of like what kind of stuff they have on there. Like if you go to the main page, a, a stripper web exotic dancer community. So it's a forum for a bunch of like anything in the more alternative like sexual type of industries, adult type industries, whatever. So the different forum areas are stripping, which was stripping general, newbie board, perfect for all you guys that are just getting into it. Um, there's frequently asked questions, there's advice for new girls, there's, oh my gosh, like 14,000 threads, 268,000 posts, and that's in stripping. For the newbie board, there's 5,000 threads and 59,000 posts. I mean, this is endless information for girls who want to be dancers, cam girls, uh, escorts, you know, uh, phone sex, like any of it. You can find all the information on here. This thing was my best friend when I was dancing early on. I would always look it up on my phone and I'd be on it all the time. I'd take pictures of what I found on online and, and flip through it later or bookmark the pages and read them later at work. I mean, they'll give you lines you can use to to walk up to customers. They'll give you the how you can spot a rich guy as, or opposed to like a, a little stunner kid there just with 20 bucks in his pocket to get one dance, you know, that kind of thing. There's so much advice on here. Club chat. <clears throat> excuse me have a question about a particular club city or state the sections for dancers keep info relevant hustle hut share or ask for advanced money making tips hustle huts badass there's so many different advices for like gimmicks outfits that get more guys like all that stuff camming connection for the virtual strippers which would be more for webcam modeling private party dancing industry insight customer conversations the lounge life support coming out body business that would be anything related to body, like exercise, clothing, surgery, all that. Um, dollar Den, stuff for taxes, fees, investing, anything like that. Picture posts, just fun stuff on there. Other work for like phone sex, modeling, escorting. Um, jobs for sale and wanted services. I mean, there's just so much stuff on here. So take advantage of stripperweb.com because it's a great website and you can get a lot of information on there. Um, what else was I going to say? Um... Mm. but yeah so don't be afraid to ask questions and the only time you're going to be a slut or a whore is if someone's giving you 20 bucks for a blowjob or something it's, that would be bad that is a slut or a whore girls who dance who provide adult entertainment are not whores or sluts they're erotic entertainers and people who don't like it can just work off so all right let's see another one comment posted on checking stuff in tomorrow this is from nixie kelly yeah, girl, thanks a million for responding to my comment about the cellulite. The coffee trick was super helpful. I'm definitely going to try it. Also, you have no idea how reassuring and awesome it was to hear that guys don't notice as much as we do. Seriously, your videos are so informative, and you're so real and honest about things that they are so freaking helpful for someone like me that has a thousand questions and no one to ask. You rock my fishnets. Two smileys. Okay, so Nixie, that's so awesome. I'm so glad that my videos help you out. Um, yeah, like, the way us girls look at ourselves in the way we look at other girls like we will pick ourselves and others apart like down to a pimple guys don't see they don't care they see boobs they see butt they see maybe a hot outfit if they even notice that but you can literally be walking around in like like I've walked around in a sweater like an actual long sleeve sweater some little tiny black underwears um because it was chilly that night and then the leg warmers I showed you guys in my one of my other videos and they don't care. They know there's boobs under there and that for a certain amount of money they're going to see it. You're at work. You're not finding a boyfriend. So, you know, they really don't notice hardly anything. Not in a bad way. Like, they can tell if you're pretty or not. But, you know, as long as you're clean, you smell good. Also, don't put a, a really strong perfume on because a lot of guys are just stopping by on their way home from work and have to go home to their wives. So you don't want them going home smelling like they just visited a whorehouse or something. So go easy on the perfume. I always go with body sprays. Um... Walgreens has, actually I have one right here, 
Walgreens has these cans. I actually got these two for six. They last a pretty long time. Um, I just draw an X over myself with the spray. This one is Viva La Juicy, Juicy Couture. If you like Viva La Juicy, you'll love our Rocket Fragrance Deodorant Body Spray. This stuff smells amazing. And they have like, I don't know, like six or eight different scents. They have like the DKNY ripoff. They have the Paris Hilton ripoff. They have that, the Juicy Couture. And they smell so freaking good. So go light on the perfume. Body sprays are better than like actual perfumes. Um, but I really think it's super kick-ass that I help you guys so much. And that like I actually can help. Like my videos aren't just me sitting here bullshitting. Like you guys actually learn stuff. And like I'm just a regular chick. So that's so awesome that I can help so many people. And even if it's not so many people. Even if it's five girls who build up their confidence. And you know even just go dance to see if they can do it. Then that's awesome. You know that you found more confidence in yourself. So I think that's awesome Nixie Kelly. And I'm glad I helped. So awesome. Alright let's see what else. Mm -mm -mm. Wow. True that girl, that was just a reply. Comment posted on stripper moves and tips. Oh, this is you too, Nixie Kelly. So after a while, do you get calluses on your feet and knees so it's not as painful to be on your knees all night and you don't get blisters from your shoes? You should do a booty clap and twerking video because that shit is hard to figure out how to do. Your dancing style is great. You really know how to move. Looks good, girl. Thank you. That's super sweet of you. Thank you again. Um, uh, actually, as far as like calluses and stuff, no. I haven't got any calluses or, or anything like that. I've had a blister or two when, when my shoes didn't fit right. Um, but if you get good shoes that fit you well, and like I said, you can blow dry your shoes. They have that. Um, let me see. Are they handy? No, I don't know where my stripper shoes are right now. But um, if you blow dry your shoes for like 10 seconds, 15 seconds, and slide your foot in, they'll mold around your foot and they'll fit you perfect. So you really don't you don't really need to get blisters get good fitting shoes and you should be fine um as far as booty clapping and twerking I, ha I thought I had a video where I taught you guys some butt stuff go to the one that's stripper moves slash tips it was uploaded on August 16th um but look at that one because I know I tried to teach the the butt wiggling in that where you shake your legs I also try to teach the butt cheek thing so watch that video because they're, I'm pretty, oh, it's on here. That's what you commented on. Wait a minute. I, I think I, that's about all I taught you guys was butt stuff. Hmm. Can you be more specific about what you mean you want me to teach you? Because, like, it's basically the same thing. You just arch your back and move your hips separate from the rest of your body. You know, you just keep the rest of your body still. Um, I'll try to make another dance tutorial type video soon. Um, cause I don't really, like I said, I don't really plan it. I just kind of make whatever, oops, whatever comes to mind, um, when I'm making my videos. So, but I'll do what I can. Um, and thank you again for your sweet compliment. Let's see. Getting ready with me, Club Makeup Part 1. Taylor Vespucci said you're so welcome. Sweetheart. She's sweet. Um, mm -mm. Joey first has sent you a message. I liked your makeup videos you just made. I think you're so beautiful without makeup, but when you do finish applying, you are just so gorgeous. Like a perfect picture of beauty, Joey. Thank you, Joey. That's so sweet of you. I'm. It's nice to know that you think I look pretty without makeup, too, because obviously some people like to hate on me for that, just for being comfortable with what I look like when I'm just being myself. Like, you don't have to wear makeup, you know? People don't have to wear makeup, so it just, like, enhances stuff, and I really appreciate that. So thank you so much, Joey comment posted on actually okay eating lucifer dick which is a weird ass name is her fucking picture really her sucking the dick uh anyways her comment says dot 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 i was a stripper in a past life dot 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 maybe which i read that while i was driving and that really doesn't apply to my video at all so i'm not sure what you mean eating lucifer dick so if you could um be more specific that would be cool comment posted on hey guys it's uploading uh, Mr. Nachi Hurt said, that's what's up, shoddy. I'll be on that as soon as you post it, Miss Certified. I like this guy. He's a sweetheart. So, Nachi, you're super cool. Thank you. I'm glad you like my videos, too. Comment posted on Get Ready With Me Club Makeup Part 3. So Cute by Sam TT. Thank you, Sam. I wish you had a profile picture so I could see what you look like. Um, but I appreciate that. Thank you. And I think that's it. Let's see. 
about it. Alright guys, so that was just my little reading my comments and stuff. Um, I like to do that. You know, I guess I, I like to actually see, talk, and respond to you guys as opposed to just typing it out. So if anyone who commented doesn't get a reply on any of the comments I just read, I'm not going to go type my reply because I just did it here. So um, I'll title this video like, let's see. Let me see what the first, what the date of the first comment was that I started reading today. Um, okay, 20 uh, comments posted. Or I'm going to name it something like response to comments September 23rd and 24th or something like that. So that's what I'll post this at. Um, yeah, but I just posted those tips videos. So I really do want to know what you guys think of that. I would appreciate you letting me know. Um, I hope you all have an awesome rest of your day, and give me some good ideas, because, like, stuff that I can actually sit down and talk or write out or stuff like that, it's harder for me to make the actual physical dancing videos just because of the pain I have, and the fact that I have my son, I really don't like to do too much of the dancing around him, like, it's okay occasionally, but I, he's with me so much that it's hard for me to get alone time to do that, so any kind of advice stuff, things like that, let me know. And don't forget to check out Stripper Web, okay, girls? That thing will... You won't even need me anymore. <laughs> Just kidding. But, yeah, you probably won't. That's a dope-ass website. Um, but I'm going to go. You guys have a good rest of your day. And I will see you again soon.